Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Nomze Wokumalo and welcome. If you are a regular viewer, thank you for being regular and viewing my videos. I hope you enjoy this one as well. If you are new to my channel, welcome to the family. I hope you feel at home. <laughs> so my video for today is how to dress modestly and classly, I mean classically classy yeah. classy all right so as a woman i'm a woman as well right we enjoy looking good guys we love looking good and um a lot of women out there sometimes you know when you want to wear your spaghetti tops and your spaghetti dresses and you just feel like you're exposing your shoulders a bit too much or your back too much i have some good tips for you ladies that can help you uh, dress uh, dress up your spaghetti tops or your spaghetti um, dresses in a classy way and a very modest way so stay tuned so um, so what inspired this video is because there are a, I feel like knowledge is power some ladies do not know how to dress in a modest way because they don't know how to maybe they want to but they don't know how to right so um that's for you ladies who want to dress in a modest way but then you don't know how to you know so this is the video for you i'm not a professional no these are just my own experiences and i'm sharing them with you guys right because it's very important to look presentable um in the world um it's, it's very important as a woman that you are modest and I always say this in my videos that the way you present yourself to the world um, is how the, the world will treat you back, right? If you're a person who is clean, if you're a person who um, dresses modestly, you will find that you will be, people will respect you, they will talk to you in a different way than a person who looks sloppy, who's dirty um who doesn't take care of their image um that person will receive a totally different treatment from the world based on how they look right so we can say that no looks are not important and looks are not everything but in reality looks are important and i'm not saying um that one should focus on looking good uh, and being materialistic and whatnot no and just focus on the outside appearance it's very important to also focus on your inside appearance as well um, in terms of um, taking care of your heart uh, your character how you treat people how you speak to people uh, to people uh, who you are is very important as well. Okay, so we need to take care of both um, Both things or elements or self first tip right for I love I love uh, you know the spaghetti I'm gonna have pictures for you guys so that you have an idea of what I'm talking about just in case you misunderstand um, just in case you are unsure about what I'm talking about when I say spaghetti sauce spaghetti string top what are they called if you're talking, spaghetti tops or dresses right? so just in case you're confused about that I'm going to have pictures up so that you have an idea of what I am talking about of what I am talking about okay so let's begin let's sip some water okay first tip ladies if you're going to be wearing um, a spaghetti top or a dress and you feel like you're exposing your shoulders a bit too much or your back a bit too much and you are uncomfortable here's a tip for you tip. if you are wearing a spaghetti vest or a spaghetti dress and you feel like your shoulders are a bit too exposed 
or your back is exposed and you feel uncomfortable and you want to look classy and uh, presentable and modestly then you can use a jacket over or a jersey over your shoulders like so you can also choose like different colors uh, colors that you uh, like and you can rock it tip number two if you are wearing a spaghetti top or a dress you can also use a scarf over your neck like so neck scarves which are also called bandanas are made up of light material usually made from silk or cotton tip number three you can okay if you're wearing tight jeans or tight skirt or a tight skirt jeans basically let's say jeans because it looks nicer with jeans or uh any pants tight pants right so if you're wearing tight pants or jeans or formal pants you can use um, an overlapping top when i when, when i say overlapping top i mean like so i'll show you a picture like this overlapping tops or cardigans are basically to help you if you're wearing tight jeans and you feel uncomfortable you might feel like oh my gosh my bum is showing all oh, my bum bum is too big so use a cardigan or an overlap overlapping shirt like hers it, um, it's overlapping um, you can also use a t-shirt and jeans and you can just leave your t-shirt hand um, at the back by your bum bum tip number five if you are a always make an example of spaghetti tops and dresses because um it's one it's it's well i enjoy wearing spaghetti tops and dresses um but then again i always struggle to i used to struggle in terms of how to dress how to make it um classy and how to make it look uh in a modest way because i was uncomfortable uh, when my back was showing or my shoulders were showing that just felt uncomfortable you know so what I also do is you can wear um, a t-shirt underneath a nice fitting t-shirt not a loose t-shirt fitting t-shirt underneath your dress right but um, or your spaghetti top but it the colors have to complement each other right you can't wear a purple t-shirt and wear it uh, let's see purple which color doesn't go with purple so basically you know what you can mix it up you can make it work you can use different colors and just see if it works for you and your skin tone and whatever and make it work right i have examples look at how gorgeous this is she is gorgeous 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 some ladies might want to wear this dress alone but look at this dress with the shirts the polka dot shirts it's beautiful uh, tip number six do not wear see-through pants or leggings or whatnot it doesn't look classy or modest you can't be wearing leggings that are see-through it, it it just doesn't look right right so if you want to look modest and if you want to look classy you can't be wearing see-through clothes it, it it just doesn't make sense <laughs> tip number seven or eight okay i'm not sure mm -hmm. okay next tip um i know i i i make this is i i i'm just gonna put myself out there that sometimes this happens to me when you're wearing something and your bra strap are showing right your undergarments you can't um when you're dressing up your undergarments cannot show they can't, they can't be out there for the world to see i know sometimes i struggle with this with like when i'm wearing like uh you know like um how can i call it dress like this that comes from here to here and i find that uh, my bra strap will start to show and stuff right so that is a no-go 
ladies don't do this right i'm working on this as well i'm not perfect so undergarments make sure that your undergarments are not showing when you are wearing the clothes thank you so much guys for tuning in i hope you enjoyed my very short video but if you want more um i have i do have another video which um which speaks lengthily about how to dress for your body type and what to do and what to dress and whatnot so if you're going to if you go to my playlist my video playlist you will see a video which is titled how to dress for your body type okay so thank you so much for tuning in guys thank you so much guys for watching my video and please subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of my content please subscribe the subscribe button is below and it's red right now because you haven't subscribed but once you click on it it's gonna turn white which will mean that you are subscribed to my channel which means that whenever i upload a video you will be able to see it and if you want to be notified every time i upload a new video please click on the bell and then youtube will notify you when i upload a video so thank you for tuning in guys i love you love you love you have a great day today's saturday for me and i'm home and it's a beautiful day the sun is out and i'm just at home making a video <laughs> so whether you're watching this at night in the morning have a blessed day toodles <laughs>